Pisces, high vibing Pisces. Pisces who are doing right and living right and know that the universe has their back. These are the ones I'm talking to. Or anyone dealing with a high vibing Pisces that maybe you want to see what they're up to or what's going on, okay? Archangel Michael, please protect me and those on the other side. Thank you for your love, guidance, and support always. All right. So you could be uh, in hermit mode as well. I feel like a lot of the high vibing people are just kind of staying to themselves right now. But you're very charming. Maybe you've been in hermit mode too long, Pisces, if you're high vibing. You're, maybe you need to put your charm out there. What's the message for the high vibing Pisces? Pisces that are high vibing. What's the message? King. All right, there you are. All right. So you're very fair. You like to help people. Uh, you could be a boss. You could own a business or be like a GM or something like that. But whatever it is, you're in charge of something. Uh, and, and you're very fair with it. All right. You're very creative and you're very fair. You try to be the best boss you can be for Pisces that are bosses out there. You're a very good boss. You want a very good business. What else do we need to know for the high vibing Pisces? High vibing Pisces. So you're going through a complete transformation as well with the death card. You could be changing your diet. You could be uh, maybe more giving. You could be getting rid of things that you're not using and giving it to charity. You could be just cutting certain people out of your life. Thinking about things that happened in the past. I feel like some of you are like um, reminiscing, they said, about just childhood stuff. Maybe shit with your family or your parents. or It, it seems like a little bit of the dark night of the soul. You may be kind of pulling in your energy and people may feel left out or like abandoned by you or some shit. Maybe they don't understand what you're going through right now, but just, just understand that uh, this is what's supposed to be happening. If you feel like you're transforming and that there's something happening to you that's a kind of supernatural or you can just tell that there's a, a higher force at play, uh, just trust in it. What's this death card, please, for high vibing Pisces? High vibing Pisces. The high vibing fish. What's up for the high vibing Pisces? What's this death card? Okay, so there you are. There you are. So this is your transformation. All right, so you are, I feel like you are being like divinely guided with this two of cups in life right now. You know you're being divinely guided. There may be some people who are a little bit jealous because I feel like you're you're changing and they don't understand it. Some people feel like, some people feel like, the, you know, uh, betrayed by you. Uh, I don't know why this is happening. This could be somebody you're with. Maybe you're, Maybe you're just getting rid of somebody or breaking up with somebody because you're just not on the same level. Maybe you're realizing that you're a little more high vibing and you just want somebody who's more uh, more like you, you know? This could be a relationship. Yeah, a relationship that you're already in with the Ace of Cups. It's just judgment, though. I saw judgment and shit in the tower. Some of you are getting divorces. Some of you are splitting up. Some of you are realizing that, like, it's just not working. This judgment could be, like, a court settlement in court for a divorce or like splitting assets or something. Yeah. So it's almost like, it's like you want to offer something to somebody. There's something that you want to offer to somebody. I feel like maybe you're having a hard time finding somebody. What is this Knight of Cups here for? But you're, you're just a very giving person. Very giving person I'm picking up on. Whether you're a male or female, it doesn't matter. So this is somebody that you're interested in. You want to offer somebody. This is somebody that you're interested in like uh, or like a romantically with the lover's card. What is this here? What's up with this lover? You could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Gemini or maybe somebody that has that highly aspected in their chart or you do. But you want to offer, you want to offer something to somebody I feel like you want to offer something to somebody, but you know that this person has a lot of options. You may be intimidated by this person. It's like you want to come in really quick and offer something, but I feel like a part of you like pulls back a little bit because you you know that this person has a lot of options or they may be with somebody else or some shit like that. 
You may be like spying or trying to get information on this person. Hmm. Tell us more. What's up with this Seven of Cups? Yeah. So you may see this person as like an angel. Or you know that this person is an earth angel that you want to offer something to. Or you want to reconcile. Maybe something happened with this person in the past. And you want to reconcile and, and find some kind of balance and resolution with this person. But you feel like this person is going to reject you. You're not really sure. So let me, uh, you know, I didn't do this for the last sign too. So I'm sorry about that. Did I cancel? Maybe I did. I don't even, I don't even freaking remember. But uh, what's, what's, some, what's some extra messages for Pisces, the high vibing Pisces? You want to reconcile with somebody, but you're not really sure how to do it or what to say. Neighbor. All right. So, I mean, it doesn't have to be your neighbor. It could just be somebody that you talk to regularly. You may be talking to somebody about this, trying to get advice. Love. Yeah. Or for some of you, you actually uh, are seeing your neighbor or somebody that lives like on your street or some shit like that. For some of you, you, you actually are dating your neighbor or you, maybe you want to reconcile with your neighbor. Yes. Yes. And karmic female. So for some of you, you left a karmic female and you want you actually like the person that you live next door to or close to you or close proximity to you. But it's a yes. I just seen a yes. So for those of you who are wondering, like, is this the right person? And this person is somebody that uh, lives on your street or lives in your neighborhood. That was a yes, dear. So good for you. I'm glad everything's working out for you, Pisces. I love you guys. Bye.